Well, the changing electorate, I think, is really important. Um, you know, we, we saw in 2012 um, uh, what I've called um, the end of the white Christian strategy among GOP candidates. Um, so uh, what we saw with Mitt Romney is he was, very, he was actually, he and his pollsters were quite surprised that he lost. I mean, all of their internal polling was telling them with, with the assumptions they had that, that he was going to barely eke it out in Ohio and then win the election. Uh, and he didn't. And, and uh, the post-election analysis that we and others have conducted basically showed that um, if he had had the same electorate that George W. Bush had um, in 2004, he would have won. So he hit all the same targets, but what happened is the electorate has changed underneath him. So basically every year, every four years, we get l fewer white Christian voters in the electorate and, and a more diverse uh, electorate. And one challenge I think for Republican candidates in particular is uh, that they have, continued to rely on about the same number of white or same proportion of white Christian voters to get them elected. Uh, about eight and 10, in fact, of Republican presidential candidates are white Christian voters. Um, and wh whereas uh, in Ob uh, um, uh, pr uh, President Obama relied on less than four in 10 white Christian voters to get him elected. And so I think it's that tension uh, that, that I, I'm really kind of watching in the election.